It's moving day. That's right for Michael Rotundo, who is the 30 year old who was evicted after his parents went to court to throw him out of the house. Joining me now is the guy at the center of this controversy, Michael Rotundo. Michael, welcome to Chasing News. How are you? Good, thanks for having me. So, Michael, you know, at first glance, people hear this story, they think, ah, 30 year old living at home, he ought to get out there and get a job. And we understand the parents, but there's a backstory here uh, relating to the custody of your son. Yes, um, my, uh, I had custody visitation of my son. I saw him three full days a week, two weekdays, one weekend day. And the county took him away from me. I couldn't see him anymore. And, and he's my whole world. He was my whole world. So I'm trying to get him back. A couple weeks after the order came down, my parents said to me, you know, we want you to get a full-time job. We want you to get health insurance. Or we don't want you, or we're going to throw you out. We don't want you living here anymore. So you said no, they took you to court. Right. Now, why did you lose custody of your son in the first place? Is it something that you can redeem? Is that, uh, is that a likely scenario? They found me uh, incompetent is what is the word that's being used. And it's basically something about me. I can't uh, have custody of my child and I can't uh, see my child without supervision. There's something, you know, I'm, I'm not a responsible person or, or something like that. Have you broken any laws? Nope. You think it's based on the fact that you don't have a job? You don't, you, don't, you don't take a father out of a child's life because the father doesn't have a job. So the court ruled that you got to get out of your parents' house. What is plan B? Plan, well, the plan was um, my, my cousin here who saw me on the news uh, pulls up near the house and he says, hey, you know, I got, I got a pick, I, he has a pickup truck. And he had a load in the truck now. He said, I'll, I can dump this off and I can help you move. He did all my moving for me. He helped me move. And um, I, I have an Airbnb booked for the immediate future for about a week or so, uh, but afterwards I can stay with him for the long term. How long has it been since you've seen your son? Since September 28th, I think, of last year. What do you want to say to your mom and dad right now? Nothing. <laughs> All right. What do you want to say to uh, your son? I, I'd rather not drag him into the, the media facet of this, of this situation. I can tell you that I told him that if there was ever, one of the last things I said to him was, if there's a time, uh, if for some reason I can't see you, and people tell you that, you know, you're not going to see me anymore. You know, know that that isn't true. Thanks, Michael. Good luck to you. All right, hang in Thank there. Thank you. I mean it. Thanks, Pat. You bet.